How's it, humans and fellow bovines? This is your good pal, Beefia. Did you all see that stupid questionnaire by the Irish airline Ryanair? The question people South African is using Afrikaans. Don't they have Google? We have 11 official languages. How many of us would pass a questionnaire in Zulu, hey? What is the Zulu word for a scam that shuts down and steals your money, huh? Kalula. Oh, they are some weird questions. And we're South African. We don't agree on anything. And I love it. What is the highest mountain in South Africa? Durban. Those guys are high all the time. They ask what side of the road do we drive on in South Africa? We drive on any side of the road we want to, including the sidewalk. They ask people to name any South African public holiday. I mean, come on. We're South Africans. We make up our own public holidays. What's today? National Shutdown Day. I've never heard of it. That's because I just invented it. Welcome to Making the Cut. My extra special guest today is a model, a TV host, known and loved across the land. She's as South African as a cook sister and twice as sweet. Please welcome, all the way from the city with the mountain with the same shape as Corbus Visa's hair, let's hear it for Minky van der Vestes. How's it, Minky? Such a pleasure to be in your company today. I feel like I'm co-starring in a remake <laughs> of Beauty and the Beef. How, how, are, you, how are you doing? How are you doing? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I like your piercings. Thank you. Yeah, I did them myself, hey? Have you ever thought of getting a nose ring? No, no. Oh, come on, it would look great. I like my ears pierced, but not my nose. Not your no. nose. Uh, you know all about beauty, right? Uh, yes. Have you got any male grooming tips for someone who looks like me? Oh, well, firstly, we can start with your, um, your chain that looks like you are the mayor of Heidelberg. Thank you! Um, wow, the extra Karen beef points for you. Fist thank bump, you. fist thank bump. You, there. Fist Boom, thank there. you, fist yeah, bump. I know, I listen, Got I your attention. Heidelberg gap in there. <laughs> Client feels, oh, our money was well spent. So let's start with the secret. Um, you look pretty good, actually. Well, thank you. Yes. I polish my horns twice a week. <laughs> Does, can you see there? I use Mr. Min. You are a South African icon. We love you, and it's great to have you. Year today. Uh, yeah. Minky, your full name is Villamine. Does anyone still call you that? Villamine. Yeah. Um, only my mom when she is angry with me, but no, that, that doesn't happen often anymore because I'm such a good girl. Oh, yeah, I'm a good um, girl, <laughs> everybody. I'm good. <laughs> How did Villamine turn into Minky? I mean, a Minky sounds like fun, like, you know. Oh, it is. Oh, it's it true. is. <laughs> Tell um, us more. So, Villamine was my obviously my granny's name. It still is my granny's name. My mom's mother, so on my maternal side. And um, Villamine and a little Villamine is a Villaminki. So, oh, wow. So that's, that's a where, long signature. Yeah, sorry, Villaminki. Anyway, Villaminki. Fun of fun of days and, days and, yes. That's so cute. Oh, it's, oh Minky. Villamine. Okay, I got it. Sorry, it took an extra. <laughs> it's Minky. Okay, Villaminki, like, like a little, a little one. one. You were 16 and in high school when you started modeling. Sure. Many, many moons ago. 3,000 years ago. <laughs> many moons <laughs> No, you're doing fine. You're looking great. You're doing fine. I'm just joking. But I mean, that must have been crazy. I mean, your did your mom used to tell you, uh, tell, tell people, oh, Minky's a model student, and then let, let them have to work it out. How did how did that go down? <laughs> no, definitely wasn't a model student. Unfortunately, um, always felt like school was holding me back. Uh, always wanted to model. Um, got a taste of it at 16, and then um, I remember my dad saying that getting your or finishing high school, getting your matric is the least you have to do. Like, you have to do that. Uh, but anyway, I get geslag, I get mooi geslag with um, what the mensen het matric vrijstelling. Um, because I just wanted to start modeling and, and travel the world. Um, in my matric year, I did amazing, amazing trips. Um, I did the SA Sports Illustrated in Zanzibar. Amazing. I went to Mystique Island. I wow. shot the uh, Max and Bikini special. Um, I did the guest camp. Campaign, of amazing. Course, which was, yes, I want to ask you about amazing. that. Oh. Ama amazing. Well done. That must have been <laughs> weird sometimes. Did you get that joke? <laughs> Who you signed with, Minky? Guess. I don't know. Guess. I don't know. Did that Did that go down? No. Actually, when you asked me now, it's the first time I ever thought of it that way. You're, ever. You're really kidding so me. So, no. No one you was honestly, ever as funny. I, I they've promise. never made that joke. Yeah. She's so lying to us right now. I promise. <laughs> you're lying. No one's ever made that joke. <laughs> I cannot believe I'm having this conversation. One day I'll also be on the front cover, hey? Uh, Farmer's Weekly Stud mm. of the Month, mm. hey? How did, how did guests find you? Guess. 
Oh, she did it to me. I'll tell you something funny. I think it's actually quite cute. You know, when you're at school, or obviously when you do well in, for your country, you're a pro tier netball player, or you're a springbok yeah. rugby player, yeah. or whatever. Um, so in modeling, you don't get colors, right? You don't, someone's not gonna no, go. No, they oh. don't go, well done, you're a springbok modeler. No. That would be strange. But I think I would have been one. Oh, yes, she's our springbok right. modeler. That's right. I think no, that would have been that's cute. Percent, I always thought of it like that. Percent, no, I'm completely. Completely with you. You're the Percy Montgomery of modeling. You're one of um you're one of our South African heroes. You're definitely a Springbok modeler. I was gonna say Thank you're you. a Bafana Bafana modeler, but that's a slightly <laughs> different kind of insult. Listen, um uh, uh, Minky, um I went to your website and I saw a recipe there for hot cross bun brood pudding cook. Uh, now, first of all, that is a real tongue twister. Let's try now. Try see what you're doing to the common person. Say five times in a row. Hot cross bun brood pudding cook. Try it, say it. I think me act with my foot in the air. Do it. Hot, hot cross, cross bun. What's it good? Brood pudding cook. It's on Brood your own website. Brood pudding cook. No, yeah, faster. Yeah, but Herman, thank you for that. Hot cross, cross bun, brood pudding cook. You're going to mess it up. You've got, gonna... I'm going to mess it up and you've obviously been practicing. So uh, I'm hot just cross bun, brood pudding cook. Yeah. Hot cross bun, brood pudding cook. It's unbelievable. I don't even have an actual tongue. It's Can we stop talking about my hot cross bun? Brood pudding, pudding cook. cook. Oh, you just, oh God. And you chipped in while I got it oh, perfectly right. God, what is your favorite dish at a bra? Please do and not say, please do not say Omar's Rask's brood pudding cook. Near, but do you want me to, like, just flace? Yo. Can I tell you my favorite cut? Yo, Which tell is us. a picanha. Do you know what a picanha is? You know where picanha is on your body? Show me. Well, no, okay. I'm going to tell you. Um, because that, that part's missing. <laughs> it's the tail of the rump. No, they took that away years ago. I'm sorry. It's very yummy. Very yummy. Should try. And then you put it in a poiki. What do you do? Me, I'll be flammer. Or just like oh, bry it. Yeah, with with I'm like with meat. With uh, <laughs> you, we bry it without. Okay, I've got some pictures of you from your Instagram. Hope you don't mind. We raided it, and I realised that I know that model in that picture. <laughs> Not you, the one on the I yogurt. Saw, I saw. I knew you were going there. Did you the realise? Way ahead. The fris. The frisqui. The frisqui. Mm. Right here, you are with your sister. Now, <laughs> She'll love that. Uh, yeah, I know. I'm kidding. She'll it's, love that. It's your mom. Great jeans in both senses of the word. Yeah, we got uh, a picture of you with some chaps. Uh, <laughs> why are they cunningly disguised as furniture from Sun City? <laughs> That's funny. I know. They, they literally look like couches from the palace at Sun City. <laughs> That's funny. I never heard that one. So my friend on the left, Yaku. Um, he bought those outfits. We were going to go on a trip and the trip didn't happen, but then he had the outfits. So then he took, he came to visit us. So he decided it's a good idea to give them to my husband and my father. Um, and then they thought it was a good idea to wear it at New Year's. I don't know why. I, I love it. I actually think it's very cute. Uh, there's another picture here. Is that you, Minky? It is me. How cute. Very. I? No, very cute. You started. Listen, that's a Villa Minky. <laughs> that, that right there is a Villa Minky. And next to you, is that a Villa Minky Minky? No, that dolly of mine was called Hunty. I don't know why, I don't know where the name comes from, but a funny story, so my girls still play with Hunty. He lives at my parents' house, and whenever they go to my mom's house or to my parents' home, um, Hunty's there and they play with Hunty. But look at the little, you missed, on the right hand side, there's also a little cat, a little cheetah. So obviously yeah, I've always had a thing for cheetahs. So Going oh, back hence to you making your husband yes, and a call back. Yes. You see, this is why we've got guests the... like this on the show. They follow the jokes, they keep up, they bring them back later. I mean, come on. Listen, Biffy, you call it, listen, man, you call it the golden thread. Wow, thank you, Minky. You were an absolute sport. We loved you. We loved your vibe. You got a great energy. You're our absolute favorite hot cross bun, brood pudding cook, <laughs> donkey. Bye bye, donkey. Thank you. And thank you for allowing me to speak Afrikaans. No, we um, love it. We love it. We love all South African languages. Lekker om, om hier te wees, om te keien met jou. Baie dankie, dit was my net so lekker. Plasier. Hamagash. Kalula. <laughs> That's an insult these days. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>